First five, a family left heartbroken and desperately trying to find more answers after their daughter was found dead near Steel Indian School Park back in February. Her family gathering today at Phoenix Police Headquarters, and that's where we find Stephanie Bennett with the latest details on this case. Steph? Good evening, guys. Yeah, it was an emotional plea for help this afternoon, and the shooting appears to be at random right now. There's so little information to go off of that police have not released a suspect description. That's where the public needs to step in. Carissa's mother. Carissa was my only child. <laughs> she was my world. Carissa was very kind and humble. She liked doing things for people. The family of Carissa Danielle Hamilton gathering to remember the young mother who was taken way too soon. There's not one second of the day that I don't think about her. I really, really miss her. And they say that time heals. It's been nine months and it seems to be getting worse every day. I don't like being alone. 29 year old Hamilton was found shot to death in a parking lot inside her gray Nissan Altima around 10 p.m. on February 5th. It happened near Steel Indian School Park near Central Avenue and Indian School Road, leaving police with no answers as to who's responsible. I never did I imagine someone would have hurt her because she was a good person. She was a kind person. Again, we're reaching out to get the help of our community to find the person responsible for this horrific crime. Her loss has left the family broken. Hamilton moved to Phoenix from Yuma in the fall, wanting to provide a better life for her son. Family says it was her dream to become a sports reporter. She was quiet and always put others first. It's been nine months since her brutal passing. They fear justice may never be served. There's a big void in our lives that she was the one that Feel that please, if you know anything, please, please come forward. She was a really good person. She had a good soul. We don't know who could have done this. So please, if you know something, please come forward. Silent Witness and Hamilton's family are offering a $10,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest. You can always call Phoenix Police directly or Silent Witness at 480-WITNESS. Reporting live tonight in Phoenix, Stephanie Bennett, Fox 10 News. Thanks, Stephanie.